up guys it's the real deal welcome back to the channel guys we are taking on disa caves ex1 today but just before we do that i want to do a massive shout out to shugs and apocalypse these two guys are absolute legends and they gave me some tricks and tips on how to beat this so really really important is the team comp and the gear so i will share that with you in a moment uh, let's just get into the disa caves and take on Scion, aka Rock Lobster. And here we go, boys. Um, so this is the team comp we're running. We've got three hunters. Literally, it can be any hunter, but you need three of them. We need Jax as our tank. He can he's not replaceable. Uh, and then we've got Anpu as well, who we need for the fight. Um, but you can pick up both these uh heroes pretty easy. And then the rest of the hunters can just be replaced by any hunter, but we're using Emma, Botmark, and Artemis. Uh, for the commander, we've got Kamota. Um, he helps the damage increased for the hunters. Praying Eyes, which is going to help uh, again with hunters, boosting their damage. Um, so every time they inflict a critical hit, increases their attack by 26% for six seconds. That is huge. Uh, Company of Heroes, doesn't matter. And Scholar's Monument, doesn't matter. We've got no healers. We've got no tanks. We're just purely going for speed and this is going to be a very very fast run so here we go boys get ready for it so Jax is going to be tanking all of this being the beast that he is um really really important is every single hunter must have attack speed boots on for us to get through this big fat chunky shield there we go and that's it it's game over now and watch this this health bar is literally going to just drop Look at that. Just pew, 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 pew. Whoa. Look at that. Just just absolutely getting smashed. Um, and then we've got Anpu, who is obviously providing us with CC and damage for that healing bug. And he's down. That's it. Game over. And here we go. One left. Ping. And almost there, guys. And that's it. The disrespect is real. Look at that, 38 seconds clear time, very, very quick, very, very easy. So Jax, you know, you should be able to pick up a copy from him in the game pretty easy. Pick up one copy and save your hybrid genes for him. Uh, Anpu, we get quite a lot as well. And I mean, Emma, there was an event recently, so I managed to pick up a few copies of her. And look at her go, she is just popping off. <laughs> I don't know what's going on there. But yeah, let's check out the builds, guys. So let's see. Oh, got to start with Anpu. I mean, my Anpu's in a pretty crazy build. He does not need to be to this level, but Immortal plus two, uh, two Awakening on him as well. Oh no, three, three Awakening. Is it three or two? Yeah, we're at level three. Nice. Um, his exclusive is maxed as well. Gear, we've got um one tempered piece. Um, and we've got him in three pieces, um, heroes. It's not the best set, but it's good enough for what we need to do for now. I mean, I could probably upgrade his gloves as well. Um, but yeah, attack percentage on absolutely everything. 30k attack, 62 accuracy. What a beast. Uh, 244k HP as well. It's always important to have some HP because they need survivability. But I probably will swap out those uh, gloves quite soon. Then we got my boy Botmark. So Botmark is in a broken set because I don't have a taxi um attack speed boots anywhere else. So the struggle is real, guys, but we will get there. Um, but yeah, the attack speed boots are essential. We need them. So rest of the gear, we're just looking for crit damage, um, crit rate, crit damage on the gloves, and then attack percentage on the helmet. 14k attack. 200 attack speed that is the minimum that is the minimum you can get away with uh almost well 40 percent uh crit rate and then we'll say 60 percent crit damage and i think the less the rest are quite quite not that evolved at all really um jacks uh mythical plus two um i think you can get away with them just be mythic um but yeah 
just what a boss, an absolute boss. He's in a crazy build as well. So two pieces of Hawkeye and then four pieces of Extraction. And we're just looking for HP, damage reduction and accuracy. Got HP on the gloves, accuracy on the helm and then 40% uh, damage reduction. Nice. So uh, 380k HP, 177 accuracy and then 57% damage reduction. Pretty sick. So exclusive is only plus 10. Uh, how's his talents doing? Could still do some more on his talents as well. But yeah, great, great hero. One of the best. So we are lucky to have um, Artemis on the account as well. And she's not particularly strong with 236 um, attack speed. Again, another broken set. Would love to get her in um, four pieces gluttony. We've only got a hero set as well. So, yeah, there's definitely work to be done on her. But yeah, you want crit rate, you want attack speed, you want crit damage, you want attack. Um, we've got crit rate on the gloves. Just because at the sort of early game, you want crit rate. There's no point in having, you know, like 100 crit damage and then 10% crit rate because you're not going to be critting. You're going to get no benefit from it. So at the moment, we want crit rate. When we get further into like late game, then we'll swap out for crit damage. And last but not least, we've got Emma. Um, so she is in four pieces gluttony, which is going to help boost our um, attack speed. So, I mean, she is very, very fast at 484. Um, but there's definitely some work to be done on here. Um, she's got quite a bit of accuracy. Um, probably needs some more attack, to be honest. Um, and of course, we've got attack speed on the boots. I mean, 3,700 attack, very, very low. 551 accuracy, probably a little bit overkill to be honest, but it's fine for now. All we care about is that speed and 484 is just enough for us to just chip away at the boss. And we've got 43 crit rate as well, so that's pretty nice. But again, so low on the attack. It's not good enough, real deal, it is not good enough. No exclusive yet either. So, you know, she's only epic plus two, but we will get there. And yeah, she's still, she's doing work for us, boys. So that is pretty much the end of the video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, hope you've enjoyed it. And I hope this helps you guys break through that EX1 barrier. Please leave me a cheeky thumbs up. Make sure to smash that smash that subscribe. And I'll see you all in a video soon. Peace.